Hello everyone. It's time to learn how to sit and hold your cello properly. As you can see, I'm sitting with my cello across my legs. This helps me support my cello when I pull out my end pin. How far should my end pin pull out? Good question. I pull it out as far as it needs to go so that when I stand up, my cello is going pretty much right in line with my mouth. I'm then ready to sit down and bring my cello toward me in the home run position. Sit down with a nice tall back and pull your cello toward you. Good cello position is like hitting a home run. Make sure that you've covered all of the bases. Here's what I mean. First base is your right knee. The bottom corner of your cello touches your right knee. Second base is where your end pin contacts the floor, about halfway between both feet. Third base is the inside of your left knee. The bottom left corner of your cello touches the inside corner of your left knee. And finally, home is right here. Your cello touches home. When all four points are covered, you've hit a home run and you've scored. We're going to take a look at this now from your side. So, first of all, we sit down with a nice tall back. We pull the cello toward you. And then we check and make sure that our bases have been covered. First base, right knee. Second base, where your end pin touches the floor between your feet. Third base, where the left side of your cello touches your left knee. And finally, your cello over your heart here at home. If you have all of these lined up, you've hit a great home run. Congratulations and happy cello playing.